Hi everyone, this is Dr. Kim, America's Holistic Butt Doctor. In this video, you'll be my patient who has extremely long toenails, who has seizures, and has a touch of dementia. Let's see how I can help her right away. Okay, now we have Maria here. Hi, Maria. I haven't seen Maria how long? Like a year? Two years? <laughs> yeah. yeah, this nail's been long like this, huh? Like, first time ever. First time ever, huh? Yeah. This nail is really long. So I was just talking. Which I think connects to her memory issues, probably. Uh huh. Yeah. You just found out that her nails like this, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you're talking about the family from Puerto Rico? Mm hmm. Yes. So how, how about your family, you're saying? Oh, no, no, no. My sister is, is there in oh. Puerto Rico. Oh, okay. That's where my mom lives. Oh, okay. Oh, that's right. Yeah. So she has not been able to go back to her home in a year. It's been a year? She's been, yeah. She's been wearing socks around the house with her sandals. Oh. Um, covering her feet. Mm-hmm. So this is a surprise. <laughs> you, you just noticed it. Um, I noticed it in December. No, December? Oh, wow. And made an appointment. Mm -hmm. um, she won't let you cut it? Hmm? She won't let you cut it? You come, uh, I did not want to risk it because she's a diabetic. Oh, yeah, that's right. So I needed to make sure I did not do anything wrong. Right. So you have to patiently wait. Exactly. Until she okay to see me, right? She was ready, but then she got sick, so we couldn't. Yeah, here, that's yeah. right. So it took a... Uh, this nail looks at least a year old now. Yeah. Look at this one. This is kind of dangerous, you know. Do you tell me your mom? Yes, that's why. Tell, tell her I said this is dangerous, especially if she's diabetic, right? Mama dice que es muy peligroso que te dejes las uñas así porque tienes diabetes. Porque yo no me las puedo cortar. She said that she cannot cut them herself. I know. So you have to come see me more often. She agrees? <laughs> She's going to do it? Yeah, but they didn't want to take her insurance. Oh, oh. So I'm having to pay for the visit. Oh, really? Why? What happened? Um, they said that, um, well, this is being recorded. I'll tell you later. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, good. All right. You can tell me later. Yeah. So now, but the point is she needs to see me more often. Is she going to see me more often? What, what, what are we wearing? Tell her her feet needs to be seen by me more often. About two, three months. Yeah. Because these thick nails and then long nails get digs into the skin and then causes infection. Yeah, she should not go to a regular pedicure, right? Yeah. Yeah, she'll They may charge you extra. <laughs> yeah, no, of course. No, no, meaning for, for like monthly maintenance while uh, she comes and see you. Yeah, every, every few months, yeah. She should come here every three months? Every two, three months. Okay, perfect. Yeah. In the meantime, can she get a pedicure or not? She could if she likes. But make sure that they, they, they do a good job on keeping it clean, you know, because a lot of mm -hmm. places are not necessarily clean. Yeah. That's the problem. A lot of people get fungal infection from the nail shops, too. So you have to be careful. This is a thick one. Yes, we were all freaking out. I'm very concerned. Yeah. Yeah. So, um... When is she going back home? I don't know. It depends when um, my sister can make the time for her. Oh, I see. Because her dad is in hospice. He's 100 years old. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. wow. Yeah, different dad. Oh, different dad. Yeah. But still, that's that's yeah. great. So, um, so they're going through that. So they don't have the time. Oh, I see. That's so. a lot. So does she miss home? Yes, she wants to go home. She wants to go home. Yeah. Yeah. 
It's kind of hard. She be, she been away from home for how long? She's been away for a year. For a, oh, for a year? Yeah. yeah. Wow. So who's taking care of the house? Um, it's closed. It's, it's locked. Yeah. Huh? No one. No one? So oh, it's just locked. The doctor locked comes in, right? But that's about it. Oh, I see. Oh, that's too long. Yeah. Yeah. How's Puerto Rico, though? How was... Remember there was a... Slowly getting better. Wasn't there a flood or something there? There was a hurricane a few years ago. Yeah, hurricane, yeah, yeah. Did, did yeah. they all recover from it? Yes. Oh, good. That was concerning. That was bad, huh? That was bad. Um, electricity grid is still not where it needs to be. Oh, really? So That's it's not all back on yet? Um, no. It's um, a lot of power outages. Mm -hmm. It's like the country is going backwards. Oh, really? Unfortunately. Yeah, that's too bad. But yeah, she died to go there, and then mm. she's stuck with me. <laughs> wow. So she will, if she feels sick, she doesn't tell me. She calls my sister. Oh, really? And I'm like, why don't you tell me? She's like, well, because you're not a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> my sister is not one either. Right. <laughs> <laughs> but my sister she, is older. Uh, but she, she... Feels more comfortable with her for some reason? Um, I immediately want to fix things. Mm -hmm, that's and, right. And You're a go-getter. You want to... Yeah, you don't want to wait around, around, yeah? Yeah, I'm like, okay, if you feel this, let's go here. Let's mm -hmm. do that. Uh -huh. And she doesn't like that. Oh, really? She, she wants to kind of think about it? Yeah, she's like, oh, no, I'm good. Don't worry. <laughs> oh, really? Like, oh, my God, yeah. Oh, man. Sometimes it's hard to yeah. help all the people. Yeah. My, my mom's the same way, too. How old is your mom? She's 84. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to go see her next week. Yeah. I haven't seen her since pandemic. Oh, my God. Where is she? She lives in Guam. Hi, it's me again. Hope you've been enjoying this video so far. If you have, leave the word long nails in the comments below. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. <laughs> hmm. She lives in, in Guam. What are you bringing her? I'm bringing her a lot of cash. What? Cash. Cash. Okay. What she, else? That's all she wants. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> she wants your love? Yes, of course. Chocolates? Chocolate? Um, no, she doesn't eat anything. She's diabetic. She, uh, diabetic? She eats yeah. chocolates, too. I know. I don't want her to eat chocolate. <laughs> you know? But oh. she, I haven't seen her since pandemic, and then my dad passed right after pandemic. I'm so sorry. Yeah, so uh, unfortunately, I couldn't go see him, right, because of the lockdowns? That's so sad. I know, it was so sad. I couldn't sleep for months because I couldn't go see him, and they were heartbreaking because they're having funeral for my dad. Three people at the funeral because they, they won't allow people to have funeral back then, right? This is uh, March of 2020. So it must have been really difficult for you. Yeah, it was really tough for me, so... Sorry. Yeah, so finally you can get to go see her now, finally. So that's the next week, you know. So I'm kind of looking forward to it. Who takes care of her? Uh, my sister, my older sister's there. Yeah, she's amazing, my older sister is. Would she come here? Uh, yeah, we're trying to get her to come here, but we'll see. You know, like I said, she doesn't want to listen to our recommendations. You see? Mm -hmm. So that's her problem. So we have I to go. understand. Yeah, so I have to go. <laughs> I have to convince her. I have to go convince her. You know. Yeah. Does she take good care of her diabetes? Uh no. Okay. Oh, well, she takes medicine and stuff. You know. Yeah. But, Mine too. Yeah, but she doesn't. She doesn't eat well, and she's always complaining. You know, there's nothing to eat, and whatever. Yeah. You know, so it's, it's not easy. Doesn't drink water. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah, that's the same thing going on, right? I'm sure you. Eighty-eight. Yeah. Pretty yep. similar, yeah. Yep, yep. yep. So this is so she had a big hallucination last month. Do what? She hallucinated last month. We all got sick, and as part of getting sick, she stopped eating. Oh, really? So she started hallucinating. Oh. And then um, it was like her sugar going down, right? But she doesn't measure it either. So I um, 
She told my sister. Uh, wow. <laughs> and then I explained to her that the basics uh, for living, you know, you have to drink water uh -huh. and you have to eat good nutrients. Right, right. So and as long as she eats that, she don't be independent. I see. So and she's getting better at it. Yeah. Is her sugar well controlled? Um, no, no. Well, we haven't tested her blood. Oh. In a year, right? Oh, really? Well, I, she doesn't want to go to the doctor. Oh, really? So. I feel honored that she came to see me. Yeah. You have to convince her, right? Yes. Wow. Yeah. yeah. It's not easy. Something about being yeah. diabetic is not easy. No, I, well, also finding a good doctor that is patient, right? Mm hmm. Um, for her. Mm hmm. Her diabetes, yeah. Yeah. Does but, she eat well though? Is she eat no, she watch her diet or she's um eat balanced although she likes sweets, but yeah. Yeah. All diabetics love sweets. Yeah. Because we don't get enough uh, sugar coming to our yeah, body. I got her taking like Amy's soups. <laughs> what kind of soup? Amy's like the Gluten-free Amy's vegetable soups. Oh, okay. Like quinoa and kale. Really? Wow. Yeah. And, uh, it's a f first class vegetables health. and, you know, organic food. Uh -huh. um, yeah. Wow. Uh, well, hopefully she'll get better. Yeah. She needs to go see a doctor, though. You know, right? a doctor that uh, she could see to get some blood work for her. Mm -hmm. No, oh, sorry. No, oh, sorry. Is it, is it pain or ticklish? Oh, tickle. Sorry. Is it ticklish? Not painful though, right? You startled me. I thought you were in pain. Hmm? Wow, that was... She okay now? Is she okay? Yeah? Not ticklish anymore? Oh, really? Oh, just initial, huh? She was kind of shocked. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Are you laughing again? Mm -hmm. Is it hurting? Oh, sorry, sorry. I don't want any sharp edges, you see? Okay, almost. Last one. And there you go. Look at you. Look how beautiful they look now. <laughs> beautiful. You see? A little photo session after, okay? Before and after, okay? But very good. I'm honored that you came to see me since you don't see any other doctors. Yes. But we'll see you in a couple months, okay? Yeah. Okay, thank you for allowing us to film you today. Thank you for watching my video. As you can see on this video with the conversation with my patient, that the stress can cause just about every medical problem we have, including seizures and dementia. Let's see if we can manage stress by worrying less and making a habit today. For more videos just like this one, tap that subscribe button, check out my next video here. Until then, be educated, get empowered, encourage others today.